My full name is John Williams Stevenson, 74 years old, and I joined the National Guard in 1970. Uh, uh, the Army National Guard right down here, this building right down here, 1970. And I served a total of 31 years in the military. And there's a lot to this story. Uh, I'm, first of all, a teacher, a high school teacher, and secondarily a soldier. And the reason <laughs> high school teaching history, in fact, was my full-time job. And uh, then I got called up to active duty with a company out of Kalispell at the age of 56 years old. And that's when I got deployed to Iraq. But most of my time in the military was the Anaconda National Guard Armory here, or I transferred up to the Fort Harrison uh, facility uh, in Helena, and I was there, and that's where I was when I got deployed to Iraq. We were gone for a year. And probably the gist of my story that I'll share with you too is that uh, probably the big part of my military story is serving that year in Iraq. And the reason that's, that makes it kind of interesting is because when I got deployed, I was 56 years old. I had already had 31 years of teaching in an Anaconda High School. And so we were doing parent-teacher conferences one night in November, first week in November. I got a call to report to the principal's office. It was an incoming call from Helena. And they said, John, you need to be in Helena the next day. We're putting together, uh, together a unit that we're going to deploy to Iraq. And so sure enough, I went up there and uh, <laughs> quote, unquote, I was selected. <laughs> I was selected to go, and uh, so I spent a year in Iraq. So I went, I taught full-time for about 30 years with uh, soldiering being weekend, weekend drills and stuff like that. And then in November 2003, that role flipped. I went from being a teacher to a full-time soldier for a year. So uh, the whole story is me, a uh, big part of the story today that I'll try to share with you is me getting deployed as a 56-year-old Army National Guardsman and deployed to Iraq to Talil Air Base with the 639th Quartermaster Unit out of Kalispell. Most of the guys that I deployed with, I didn't know. I was a, they, they were short of manpower in that unit, so they called in people from all over the state of Montana to try to fill the vacancies in that unit. So that's how I ended up from being uh, in a company at Fort Harrison, Montana, to be uh, with the 639th Quartermaster in Kalispell. And like I say, many of those men that I deployed with, and women, there were women, uh, I didn't know, I was the new kid on the block, or kind of the new kid at 56 years old, you know, so in fact, I was kind of the grandfather of the, of the unit, you know, pops, for sure. <laughs>